Say man, hey man. It's your boy Do It All Hollywood back with another NBA 2K24 next gen build video. And today I have a special center build for you guys that will be able to do all the things that you need a center to do on the court. I did give this build a 95 strength so we can get that Hall of Fame and Move Boy Enforcer. And we also have some other things that will allow you to have some fun. So make sure you guys watch the video to the end so I can show you the masterpiece. Choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. But before I go into further, you already know what time it is. If you don't know now, you know. It's the like button time. And I need you guys to go down there, hit that like button, get this video to 100 likes. And if you haven't already, hit the link in the description and join the Discord. Hit the link in the description to follow me on Twitch. And also, man, follow my TikTok if you guys are on TikTok, man. They ban. Uh, my page so I had to make another page so the new page is do it all haul clips on TikTok man they got me on my regular do it all haul 2k so if you are on TikTok out there man please go follow that page so I can get it back up I almost had like 5k uh, followers over there so center build uh, 7 foot tall 249 on the weight 77 wingspan let's get into it so we're gonna go ahead and start with the finishing now with the center you want things like stand and dunk, um, you want post control, you want close shot. The layup is not all that important, the drive and dunk is not super important, depending on what you want to do, if you want post to rise and all that stuff. But uh, for the close shot, we're going to get that to a 77. That does allow us to get uh, fearless finish on silver, we get master on silver, uh, we get giant slay on gold, pro touch on gold, as you can see. Um, for the driver dunk, we're going to get that up to a 73, and we're going to let the layup go up with the dunk and just leave it right there. I think you're fine with that. We do get posterized with the 73. As far as the standard dunk, we're going to get that up to an 85 so we can get fast twitch on silver, rise up on silver, and we get area wizard on gold, and we also get some big man contact dunks. We get the pro. Okay, for the um, post control, we're going to take that up to a 75. And that does give us some silver uh, post scoring badges like drop stepper, post being technician, okay? But let's go down to the physicals. Uh, we're going to go ahead and take the speed up. We're going to get the acceleration up, the strength. We do have that 95 strength on the build, like I was saying. For the vert, we're going to get that up to 80. Y'all know how we feel about the shot blocking. And we're going to go back up, as you can see. We do get um, hook specialist on this build. We get Dream Shake. We also get Post Fade Phenom. I think that will go up to gold, I want to say. Uh, we get Bag Down Punisher on this build. And we also get Unpluckable. So we're looking pretty good with the finishing on this build. Even though we have Browns Poster Rise, I think you're fine. Um, we got that high close shot, so we won't miss anything around the rim. But let's go ahead and get it to the green bean. Make your girl scream, baby. This build does have a high mid range shot with an 84. Um, the reason for the 84 is, is so we can get gold catch and shoot. We got gold post fade phenom. We got gold guard up. We got gold comeback kid. And we got gold midi magician. So we have some pretty good badges when it comes to the shooting in the mid range area. If you want to um, do that, it's totally up to you. As far as the three point shot, we are going to take that to a 78. That does give us corner specialists. As you can see, we got Claymore. Dead Eye, Blinders, Green Machine, all on silver, so that's pretty good in my opinion. We also have Open Looks, and you know, that's good for a center. Anytime you can space the floor, man, it's always good. Um, you don't want to go out there with a paint clog or somebody that's just sitting in the paint uh, with their hands up. You don't want that, you know what I'm saying? You want somebody that can move around, get to the three-point line, pull the center out of the paint, and, um, you know, open up some things for the slashes on your team. Every team be having slashes, so... Um, if you know if you have a slash on your team, then that will open up the lane for that particular person, okay? Um, but it's up to you. And if you want to go with that 84, some people may want it higher. So if you do want to higher, just take your wingspan down. Um, that's up to you. And um, you know, you'll be able to get what you need to get when it comes to the shooting. But I think this is fine. This should be able to get the job done. But let's go ahead and get into the sauce. But before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody named mama can see this video. And I need everybody named mama to see the video, so do that for your boy, boy. Now, with this build right here, uh, we did want some passing. Okay, so we want the passing um, in order to get break started, right? So we're going to take it up to a 77. I just took it to a 77 for the hell of it to go ahead and give you guys bronze needle threader. Uh, but a 75 passing would be 
enough to get the job done because you'll have um, silver break starter. So that's a badge that you can use to get the ball to your teammates on time on target. You also have post playmaker. So once you get in the post and you know you can't get to get a um, shot or whatever, you pass it out. Your teammates get a boost. It boosts the shot percentage on passes made out of the post to a shooter. Okay. Um, for the speed with ball and ball handler, we're just going to leave it where it is. You know what I'm saying? 42 ball handler, no speed with ball. We're not worried about that. Okay. Let's go ahead and get it to the defense. Now, with the defense on this build, we want to make sure that we have enough interior defense, shot blocking, and rebounding. Now, perimeter defense and steal, that's optional. I don't think it's a need. But if you want it on your build, that's fine. Go ahead and put it on your build. But with me, I like to focus on the main things, interior defense, block, and rebounding and then steal and perimeter defense they'll be like secondary okay so for the interior defense we're going to get that up to 82 okay that does give us post lockdown on silver as you can see um we're going to take the block up to 87 that does give us anchor on silver we get chased down on gold and we will have pogo on gold as well uh, once we take the rebounding up but um the main thing is the shot blocking you know 87 block it may not seem like a lot most people would say um, 87 is good enough, which I agree. Uh, but if you want to go ahead and go with 92, which I was going to try to do, um, if I, I I was going to go 92 block and try to get a 95 um, st uh, strength at the same time, but I would have to take something else down. And I didn't want to do that. So if you want the 92 block, uh, take your strength down to a 90. Uh, you just had to make some adjustments, but it still can work. You just had to take something down. Okay, so that's what we got. Um, we also have um, workhorse on this build as well. So with the perimeter defense, we're just going to leave it right there. Still, same thing, just leave it right there. Now with the rebounding, normally I don't do this, but, you know, sometimes I do. Uh, we're going to flip it around, do defense rebounding high and the offense rebounding low. A lot of people like it like this. I don't, me personally. Um, I'd rather have offensive rebounding than defensive rebounding. So um, that's just my personal uh, preference. Um, but, it, you know, a lot of people do it this way right here. So we got Hall of Fame box, we got gold pogo, and we have gold rebound chaser on this build. Okay, so that's pretty good, right? Um, as far as the speed, we got a 66, so that's enough to get us chase down artists on gold. If you take it down, as you can see, that will go down. Uh, we have a 57 acceleration, which is pretty good. 95 strength to get that uh, Hall of Fame immovable enforcer. We have an 80 vert, so we can get all these badges that you see to the right. And the rest is on stamina. And we also have gold workhorse. But let's get into the shades of are you ready? Because guess what? I do not click, but here we go, here we go, here we go now. We do have shades of Sabonis, we got Valetunas, and we got Vucevic. Okay. All those guys are great passing uh big man and you know they can do their thing in the paint. And we do have the spot up threat. That's the bill. Make sure you like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, I'm out of here, man. Charge!